just a quick video folks this is an um, a thermal imager with a warning system a warning alarm system type of thing based around an SP32 obviously that's got an integrated super eight inch TFT screen but I'm using this sensor been around a while AMG double eight double three it's only a 64 pixel sensor but You'd be amazed what that can achieve. Okay folks, I will upload the full build of this. I haven't got time at the moment. I've got to go work. But this is the full the full thing. It's an ESP32 CYD. Buy them from about £9, £10. It's got a, a transparent case, as you can see. Covers everything important. And the module itself, the AMG 8833. You can get these for about £10 UK. There's only three parts to the whole build. How cool is that? Easy to build. Very little soldering. Just in four wires. Sink. Data. 3.3. Ground. Code. Not much code. I supply the code. All done for you. That's the file. You do simply them four wires you solder. Load this code. Load the libraries. Click that. And that will install it straight to ESP32. Full build coming up soon, folks. See you soon. Just a quick video on my new project. As you can see, it's an ESP32. Used a lot of these. It's got a sensor inside there. Originally Panasonic. An AMG 8833. It's only an 8x8. So it's a 64-bit, 64 64-pixel 64 sensor. Doesn't sound a lot, but still usable. Now the reason I built this was because of this. I've got a few electric, couple of electric bikes and I charge, I normally charge it up in the garage. Well, normally in the garden to be honest, but the UK is always like that. Wet, raining, so I charge that in the garage or in the garden if I can. But I'd like to keep an eye on it. Because it can take six, seven hours, eight hours to charge, and I can't really be in the same in the garage for that amount of time. But I wanted to design a device that I can keep an eye on it, temperature-wise. And I designed this. What I do now? I plug that in. Put this thermal imager, if you want to call it that, watching the battery, and any change in the temperature. If it starts to get warm, because it doesn't really get warm at all, but if it starts getting hot, this will warm me. Now, uh, how about this warm me, you say? What have these got? These ESP32 CYDs have got integrated Wi Fi. And what have I done? I've streamed it straight to my phone. Look at that. This is a direct connection to my phone. And I've got a fresh old alarm on there. So if anything gets warm, it's going to scream at me. So I'll just keep this phone on me and I can monitor it. Yeah, that's how sensitive this is. Yeah, that's me, that is. That's my head. Not bad for an 8x8. I can't really lift my hand. Because I was showing my arm moving. But these are great. I mean, for what they are, a, a simple sensor. I mean, if I open the door of this fridge, you can see it on here, look. Wow. <laughs> now, the, the idea of this quick video, I want to show you the build of this in my main video. Look at that, great, and it live feed, straight to the phone. So what I'm going to do, show you how it works so you just put it there all right now it's watching the kettle in it obviously what happens with the kettle when i put it on it gets warm doesn't it so we'll put it directly opposite i ain't had the kettle on for a while so it should be cold you can actually see that can't you and this is the the fountain so what i do i lower that down i don't want to lower it too much Let's turn the sound on. Is that a full blast? It is now. 
you can adjust the settings you can adjust the threshold here of the alarm alright then that's watching the kettle now as you can see should we turn it on? alright I don't know how long that's going to take hopefully not too long because this is a um, short video I've detected it eating up already haven't you? just turned it on the kettle's not exactly a quick kettle you definitely see it's warming up Now you just think it'd be watching the battery run it and I love that on a very low setting so even if it got to probably about this stage the alarm I sound. So basically this is just a cheap a cheap system to keep an on a charging battery. Good at it. Oh it's showing a bit of red. Oh it is. There you go folks, this is exactly what I wanted. How effective is that? I'll put the full video up of the build next week.